do you know how to ride a bicycle? All right, a little bit of a different bike ride today. Uh, mentioned last year that we bought a little house in, in Bucerias, Mexico, near Puerto Vallarta. Bucerias is a super cute, quiet little town, just 20 minutes from Puerto Vallarta, which is very spring breaky. Bucerias, you know, you can get your drink on, but uh, nice, quiet beaches and a relaxing environment. I've done all, I've been there many times. I've done all kinds of epic, incredible rides from Bucerias. The one thing I haven't got to do, the one ride that I've wanted to do the whole time is Pepe's food tour. Now we all love Mexican food. They take pride in their food here. As shown by the guy on the flight out who had a carry-on full of tortillas and only tortillas. There was no underwear, there was no other bag. So we're down here this weekend. It's Emily's birthday, Bought a couple friends. And we're gonna do Pepe's food tour. Pepe has uh, come on a bunch of the trips that I've done. He's a legend and I wanted you to experience him on the channel. Uh, and I wanted some chilaquiles. A few little bike shop in Bucerias uh, provides uh, e-bikes. So literally anyone can do this ride. This is like 20 minutes at a time, and then you eat and you stop. And uh, you know, it's, it's, it's this pace. Yeah, real good, real good. Yes. So the three ingredients is, is, is a cinema, club, and piloncillo. It's how the Mexican start to drink coffee on the revolution's days. The option is uh, chilaquiles. Are you familiar with chilaquiles? Oh. Yes. Those chilaquiles are really good. Yeah. No, normally chilaquiles has to be spicy. Should I be using a fork? The name of Isabella de las Maderas changed to Buceria. The Buceria means diver. So you know Mexican, we do tacos of everything. <laughs> so now they are another easy way to eat birria is making taco. And the good ones, the good ones are the crunchy. How many different combinations of salsa can there be? Oh, it's a math question. Oh, permutations. Oh, Permut oh yeah, that's a good, that's a good math uh, word. I haven't been to college in a long time. <laughs> well, it's eight, eight to the eighth power, right? Isn't that what that would be? Wait, is eight sauces. Okay, third stop is fish tacos. Mm -hmm. uh, fish empanizado fish taco. It's just covered with eggs and, and bread. And has like a little, a little deep fry. And the fish uh, is mahi-mahi. Uh, this one is spicy. Keep and the, other, me. the other one, the, this one is just chipotle salsa. Okay. And this is uh, jalapeño. I won the fish tacos. Yeah. Oh, you're second. Mm -hmm. Right includes a free massage. If you like your butt massaged. <laughs> the last stop, ice cream. There's only six more stops. No, the ice cream was the last one. Headed back to, to BC Boosteries to drop off the bikes. Yeah, get that. <laughs> so let's remove my credit card from your, your Instagram. Just out of curiosity, what's your billing zip? Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. So this is this is the blue the, this is the blue That's agave. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, agave. Yeah, yeah. And sometimes those guys are really big. Yeah. yeah I know. And normally these ones grow close to Guadalajara tequila area. Mm -hmm. Is that's why the name of the te the alcohol tequila, because the tequila was start to made in the town of the tequila. Mm. Oh. Salud. 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 So we've been out like two and a half hours, four different stops. Uh, great time this morning with Pepe. I'll put a link in the description. I've come here many times. There are a bunch of places that we hadn't tried before, more locally spots. Uh, got a good history, but highly recommend. This is not the usual kind of ride that we do, but maybe maybe it should be. Maybe I'm effing this up with all that pedaling. Gracias, Pepe. Adios. Nos vemos. 
Emily, next trip we gotta do the wine tour. 